I have made many many videos about this but this is one of the most important behaviors that you can teach your dog is to have a ritual a calm ritual before having food so we don't ask our dogs to lie down the moment they see that their food is being prepared they already assume this position they already go to rest by themselves this is because of years and years of practice and whether I train uh, the sit or the down or the recall this I make sure happens every single day and just having the food over there in their respective places doesn't mean that they can go and eat I can actually leave this place and no one is here and I'm going to come back I'm going to put the video on pause and I'm going to come back and they'll be right there so I've just returned back now so just because the food is there and no human is around doesn't mean that they can go and eat so this comes with training so I'm going to release them one by one Kari and Kodakan so just because I call his name doesn't mean that he can go and eat. Very nice. Yes. Good. So I've released one dog to eat and the other three should still hold their position. Booming Ivama. Good. Good girl. Zits. Yes. Helga and Giva. Yes. Good boy, Sada. Sada smart boy, Dikanya. Sada, yes. So, this is a very, very important exercise, and this avoids all sorts of problems that the dogs may exhibit with regards to conflict and dominance and all that. So, please practice this on a daily basis. If you don't practice anything else, practice this food discipline and also there should not be any food aggression that food aggression concept itself is just nonsense see I can I can remove the food and this is not to show off or anything it is to impress upon you how important it is to, to practice this because no one wants to get bit by their dogs so even if you so even if you don't practice the sit down and all that this you have to practice the dog should tolerate you taking its food away because basically my dogs are not scared of me they are not afraid that I am here to take their food away that is the reason it is not dominance if it was dominance if I approach they will run away it is just the dog understanding that I do not pose a threat to their food So this is a very very important thing to train for the welfare of you and your dog. Hope this was useful.